How's it going? Welcome back to Overlord Undesired. A uh, few quick announcements before we start. Unfortunately, um, Fritz will no longer be joining us because he died in a horrible accident because he thinks hot dogs are a sandwich. Kill me is. too, coward. <laughs> They're both wrong, in my opinion. That but is that's not the a wonderful thing about opinions. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> uh, he's back from vacay. Um, Fritz is, so we can always see how his little little children are that split from him, um, which is going to be fun. Um, also, um, I'll be announcing this in the Redwall campaign and the Beyond the Horizon campaign as well. I will be starting a new job this Monday, probationary period. I don't know what my hours will be like, and I don't know what days I will be working. So depending on what days, take that down right now. No, <laughs> no looking at this court. Keep going. Anyway, as I was saying before, I was rudely interrupted. Uh, where was I? Now you made me lose my train of thought. You don't Thanks know your for. new hours. Oh yeah, I don't know my hours yet. I'll start training Monday, and until I found out find out what my hours are, I probably will probably be playing word of mouth and we might have to switch it around a couple of days or reschedule things due to this new job because I want to earn some faking money. <laughs> sadly, this program does not allow me to pay anybody, sadly. Um, <clears throat> let's see here. What other announcements? Um, hmm. oh, during one of our breaks tonight, I really got to get your opinion on something. Anyway, um, last time we left our heroes, last time we left our heroes and last session, it was interesting to say the least. There was m murder of the tentacle degree, um, by, uh, someone who decided I'm going to touch this stick and then they transformed. Um, so the family line of um of mr uh brimley miss uh, uh lord will former lord wilford uh no longer exists all because of synth congrats on synth's part yeah uh yeah. silence her babies had a little transformation and after po after after poking an orb you know, as cats do, they like touching things that don't belong to them. Hee hee. I'm knocking your cup I'm off the table people. right now. <laughs> Everybody uh, has to touch everything, don't they? <laughs> uh, Rosu, um, who is currently thinking to herself, do I need leashes for each one of my party members? She has yet to realize what happened to said orb. She's more worried about the endangerment of Sir Knight coming back. Uh, so that sounds so wrong <laughs> on so many levels. <laughs> uh, for those watching the live stream or uh, oh. back at home, he said, not going to lie. I didn't know that touching other people's sticks would make me a hentai. But stuff happens, I guess. I just you got the other part of that. You that anyway you Want chat? I made chat bigger so they could see it on screen now. Ah, okay. So, does that mean Synth is now a hentai protagonist? No, almost, but not yet. How about we stop talking for a while? <laughs> <laughs> you think they um, will listen to you? No, oh no. Um, uh, and by the behest of his temporary master, Silence, Mister Valif went off for the next 30 hours to do his mission. And we come back to a very disappointed Fritz because oh. so where what we decided what his character was probably doing that entire time was trying to find the goddess in the forest, trying to show off his babies. He could not find her. Well, to at least let her know that, yeah, there's more of me now. <laughs> yeah, you could not find her because she's not currently in the forest. <laughs> Well, I send her a prayer to let her know, at the very least, all in nature, you know. 
commune with it. You don't have commune. I know. He means by commune, by commune, he means he's taking a massive dump in the fucking forest. No. no. I didn't think he had, like, bowels. I was going to say he's a slime. He's usually doing the opposite. He had to get rid of, like, some of the stuff he couldn't die, uh, He couldn't get rid of as a slime. Somehow. I'm kidding. Um, um, Fritz, you see that your companions are getting ready to leave. Okay, then I, uh, slurp on over and I'm like, so where are we going? Where are we leaving to? Home? Um, <clears throat> we're heading over to, I'm going to say it wrong, I know I am, in Rentel. To drop off the ears and other gross monster parts to the guild, get paid, then go home. Oh, by the way, he's coming along with us as she oh. waves her hand to said NPC. Not NPC. R- person. Human. I slurp right up to him. Hello. I'm like right in his face, too. Could you be more specific, Rozu? Because some people who may have not seen this stream before might not be familiar who you're talking about. Uh, give me a moment. I suck at remembering names. Let's see. Let's close this. By the way, Rozu, I couldn't be more proud of the fact that you did pronounce it correctly. Oh, I did? Oh, so happy. So I'm going to give you inspiration. Oh, click. <laughs> hush, hush. Pronouncing sword. Uh, oh, that's a that, that's just dragging me out. <laughs> I'm trying to look for his profile. I'm not seeing it. You don't understand. This has been a long time coming. I'm so <laughs> proud. Uh, I don't remember because I can't find said character in information. And I'm Does not going to cheat and else? Google it. Yeah. Does anyone else want to help her? Do they have information? I highly doubt Fritz does. My memory is worse than a like a fucking rat. I well, well, depending on the rat, it could be an amazing memory. Okay, well, I'm just a rat that you found on like the streets of New York, bro. Oh, I was thinking like Clooney the Scourge, but no, that's a different rat. rat. Or the rats from the (laughs) Secret of Nim. Stupid little rat. He's Googling everybody, and uh, while hush, this hush. is happening... I am trying to remember. While this is happening, um, uh, not that can night. I get a perception check from everybody? Okay. Uh, character sheet. If you have advantage on hearing, then please take advantage on that. Hold on, checking my... Awesome racial barities. Oh well, poor silence. You you re-rolled a three. At least it's relatively yeah. decent. Uh, oh, would no. this be passive perception? Because I get a plus five to passive perception, so that would be a twenty then on that. <gasps> nice. Um, what is your passive perception naturally? Uh, my passive no. perception is twenty-two. Then I would. Uh, I think your passive perception would work better for you in this instance. All right. Yeah, I I hear everything. Um, Everybody is relatively good. Um, As you all are standing there menacingly. I'm kidding. Um, (laughs) um, You all hear a magical sound in the distance. It's not necessarily magic in nature, but it's the sound of you need to um, start getting on the road of the sound of distant thunder. Mm. Well, I guess it's best to go, though. And how do you I... pronounce that, Rosu? Brain <laughs> Uglis. <laughs> I Unglaus. 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 Wow. I'm taking away your insp- oh, I'm kidding. <laughs> no. <laughs> that would be brutal. You, I, I understand what that last name it is. If you didn't watch the anime or like are not familiar, uh, like while. without, <laughs> yeah, it, it would be difficult for you to pronounce that. It's Unglaus, Brain Unglaus. I mean, so DM me it, but I found it just as he did it. Yep. <laughs> well, I'm right in his face right now. <laughs> 
He's looking him up and down and say hello. Um, he seems nonplussed about your presence, but he's more curious on the fact that how you can talk. You hear him mumbling something to himself about where's the brain as he's poking you with a stick. All the flowers are in his head. And as he pokes me with a stick, the stick begins to grow. Or it grows uh, leaves on it. Holy shit. It looks at the stick, looks at you, looks at the stick, looks at you, looks at the stick, looks at you. I'm a chosen of the of, of the goddess of the goddess of the forest or of nature. Uh this Rose who? Yes. You're aware that this slime can talk? Unfortunately. Yes. Also I mean turned to, to him. Form in front of him. <laughs> I'm not mean to him. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to the person that oh. was surprised that he could talk. <laughs> He's an adventurer, right? Well, that's still kind of mean. That's the normal way, he can understand you. It's, it's totally understandable. Oh, I'm not an adventurer. Oh. See, there's no excuse. And then I go, by the way, these are my children. Is it like, hello, hi, hello. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Can we get on away, please? I don't need to be an adventurer. I'm the son of a duke. Oh, so you got that cushy life, huh? In Hardly. Son? Wait, is he telling the truth? I don't know. Is he? My you need eyes. You give me an inside check. No, don't she can need automatically to tell do the that. Truth. As Rosie just, like, blink really hard and just stare My at him or something? My eyes of the gods should tell me if he's lying or not. Well, see, that's, that's why I was being specific with you, is because, again... Some people might be watching oh, right. your stream for the first time. There. The eyes of the gods. And you, and you fail. Yeah. Okay, so basically she has a specific ability due to the fact that she is of the uh, seraphim uh, race that allows her to mitigate uh, possible like insight roles. And it allows her to see the absolute truth of someone's nature. And he is indeed telling the truth. He is of the same rank as you. Huh. Um, and he and he was like, I have just no desire for I have no desire whatsoever to use my family's money. So I chose a life of mercenary work instead to earn my own damn money. How rank does he smell? <laughs> He actually smells like lavender. That is surprisingly. Oh, so he's still taking the money, isn't he? <laughs> no, actually, <laughs> he just out. took a bath before he was kidnapped. His hair is actually still wet. Hmm. Talk about Fritz. Fritz probably smells like flowers. Yes. Which is a great change. <laughs> All right. Well, I think it was just an acrid smell originally. You know, acidic. <laughs> yes, that's still not a lovely smell. Yeah, right. before he transformed into this, uh, this nature slime, basically what you smelled like. Have you ever wanted to, uh, 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 have you ever, like, seen those animes to where, like, uh, the food that someone makes is so horrible that it's censored? Or it comes alive. He's censored? Yeah, yeah it's oh censored. Yeah, and it, and it has, like, that green fumes coming off of it. That's what he smelled like. That's what Fritz smelled like. <laughs> oh, and so we got to, like, what? Like, if he was in water, does he just, like, become the water? I feel like we talked about this before, but... No, sorry. Like, no. if he was to go in water, would he just, like, become in the water? Is he, like, oil and, like, floats or something? No. no. Well, well, the past him would have sunk like a faking rock. You just haven't tested whether or not this new version of him can swim. Oh, that's ah, right. Exciting. He's not part metal anymore. I wonder if he would dilute. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I like, don't can know. we like mix him in? Most can we get like of a big you spoon? just wanted to avoid getting him in the water because you learned that there are fish that eat creatures like him. I bet you he'll float <laughs> like a lily pad. That's the if hopeful got, situation. If we got like a big spoon, could we like stir him in? A big Spoon. <laughs> a big spoon, a big ladle. Well, I'm sure we have, like, I don't know, a shovel? A barrel that we could fill up with water or something, stick them in. Experimentation. Fritz is just oh, like, pest. you planning? Don't worry about it, buddy. Oh. <laughs> yep. I've been trapped in a pickle jar. No. A what? A pickle jar. <laughs> He's traumatized. What a weird dream you had. Lake will be much bigger. Don't worry about it. 
Yeah, we're just gonna do some slanging. Let's not get the dragon upset. No offense, but are we going? Yes. All right, I would like to actually be on the road <laughs> before the storm hits. Storm? Yeah, hey, I remember the thunder thunder earlier. I the thunder. Yes, I was absent-minded. Yes, let's go with that. Well, don't worry. Along the road, if we go now... I know of a place that we can hold up until the storm passes us by. Well, our keep is only like two or three hours away. Erantel is only probably an hour away from here. Storm will be around 30 minutes from now. Oh. oh drive past eat ass. Let's go, boys. <laughs> oh, hold geez. on. I want to see something. I got spell slots back. I... How many horses do we have? we drive fast and eat ass? How many horses do we have? on the horses? Uh, how many horses do you have? Yeah, on the carriage. You have two. They're both draft horses. Okay. I'll give them both pats and pass two times. Enhance ability. (laughs) Of both of them. Generally? Rosa, you are putting these horses on crack cocaine. (laughs) What, you want to get stuck in the weather? Hold on. I don't, but you know how horses can smell fear? They're going to be able to, like, I don't know, like, be sentient. <laughs> well, it depends on what, what are you increasing. <laughs> Their ability. Yep. She didn't specify, so I, I'm going to take did... advantage of that. Well, it doesn't tell me I can choose the ability. I figured they choose the ability. Uh, Rosa, you actually... are fucking up these horses big time. <laughs> Rio. Rio. I mean, if I had to choose the ability, I would not let you summon a bigger demon. Rio, there's actually a second part to that spell that tells you that you can choose, like, Eagle Splendor, uh, Bear's Endurance. This is a custom one. Oh, it's custom? Yeah. This is enhance a random ability of a creature. Yeah. You're going to kill these horses. No, they're just stronger now. (laughs) Or more intelligent. (laughs) Okay, so what I'm going to do... Is to be fair, they have six abilities, so I'm gonna roll a d6. Why don't you increase their intelligence and then they can just think like humans and then we just got human horses? <laughs> One's more charismatic. Uh, okay, let's see here now. Be horse? Let's see here and boom. Okay, that's. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What happened? Oh, I'll I'll keep that well, to myself I go as you back in the carriage you, and yep. I'll activate my because I finally want to sit back and relax. My little orb of altered self that I had from my chest of stuff. And we're gonna sit back as if I never have wings and joy. Okay. <laughs> Who's driving? Nose goes. <laughs> nope. I can drive. All right. Uh, you transform into your human self, and you, as you do so, uh, the mysterious individual known as Brain Unglaus just watches you do so. Yep. Oh, this is going to be a long trip, isn't it? And by the way, I give him a wink. <laughs> this is going to be a very long trip. <laughs> as the horse proceed to head out. I do have a nine in ha- animal handling, so. But can you handle the drug horses? <laughs> They're not drugged. Mm, we don't maybe. know what they are. As the horse start to take one step forward, animal handling with disadvantage. Oh. Disadvantage? Rozu, yep. you fucked up big time. <laughs> <laughs> hush, hush. What did you do to these poor horses? I don't know why I'm talking in this long <laughs> 16? 15. <laughs> I still look good. Come on. You fucked up big time. No, 16. No. Okay, so I'm. Uh, so here's the good news. You barely managed to pass. Ooh. Here's the bad news. Everyone else in the cart needs to make dexterity saving throws. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Poor fucking horses. <laughs> uh, I'm checking. Don't get a zero, or you're gonna fly out the back end of the truck and probably die. Okay, I got nothing to help me with saving throws. Okay. Deja vu. Good luck. Okay, uh, Rosu, as you begin to relax, you all of a sudden feel a big lurch. 
but you manage to hold yourself back and actually start to relax as the horses who are draft horses in a new world normally these new world horses can reach a maximum speed of 35 miles an hour including the thing that they are pulling you enhance their speed which made it increase by two. So that's, I'm terrible at math. So give me a sec. It means we get to tell a lot faster. <laughs> oh, but when I do random things, I get yelled at. But when you do random things, we get to town faster. Rizzy's <laughs> just like, what the fuck did you do to these horses? <laughs> I patted them and said, good job. So. Um, these horses are now going 105 miles an hour. <laughs> oh what the fuck? <laughs> Woo! You are zooming, to say the least. Well, we're definitely gonna get, it there, get there before 30 minutes. Can someone put on, like, the Mario Kart OSP, please? Well, <laughs> unfortunately, that's copyright. Put some racing music on here. Um, uh, Imagine with some deja vu. Normally, <laughs> what would take you like three hours is going to take you about just an hour to reach your destination, which is home. Yeah, yeah but I thought we were stopping in Rantel first. Oh, you ran to home? Yeah. You do manage to get to Rantel in time, yeah. Yum. With like 10 minutes to spare. Oh my gosh. See, Fritz's hair is now blasted back. <laughs> You'll have hair. Oh, wait. No, you're in your human form. Uh, brain, brain being the playboy that he is, um, his hair just naturally flows gently in the wind, no matter how fast he gets going. Kind of like Fabio. Islands is just like fucking blasted. <laughs> And, uh, all of a sudden, when, whenever, uh, all of a sudden, uh, whenever you, uh, yeah, <laughs> I can just picture that. Whenever you stop, all of a sudden, silence. You go as your fur just goes frizz. You are now a fluff ball. What the fuck? Then rain hits. Well, well, we got 10 minutes that, rain. Yeah, you, <laughs> you're currently in Iran Tell, and you head towards the Guild Hall. As you park the horses in the stables, you manage so to get inside as the first raindrops are coming down. And that's how you get here without worrying about a storm. The horses are currently consuming water like no tomorrow. Rosie, what yeah, the they're... fuck did you do to those poor horses? I just gave them a little bit of encouragement. Was it encouragement or was it drugs? <laughs> how? No, never. This isn't. Was it okay, we're not. I just gave him a little pat. Was, was that pat horse cocaine? No. I'm not gonna lie, Rosie. I've never seen a horse sweat before. They're sweating. What the fuck did you do, bro? Also, those horses are eating a lot. No, they're drinking. Oh, drinking a lot. But yes, they had nice exercise. exercise. Rosie, they were going like a. I, I wish we had like a speedometer right now or something. Because what the fuck? <laughs> Let, let's just get the stuff in. Sell Look it. at me. Am I fit to go into town like this? I'm going to get made fun of. Staying down the grainy, your fur will come down. Uh, like well, cat. you do manage to, like, calm your fur down as you, like, head through town after getting in through the gates. That's Fritz over here with his babies all around him. <laughs> My aunt's pouting. Um... As you come towards the, uh, like, uh, like as you head into the guild hall, uh, Fritz, you have a sudden thought in your mind, like, oh, right, these are slimes. I'm not sure how people will respond to multiple of these in a public area. You turn and you just see a set of four kids, all with the same hair, glasses but varying different outfits precious babies as they're holding each other's hands as they head inside oh my god Adorable. they have Chris this vacant me. stare on them they haven't managed to perfect human emotion so they more re are reminiscent of those twin little girls but quadruplets from the shining that's cute oh. that's creepy like come play with us forever they just have that vacant stand, the, a stare. Uh, Fritz, well, Fritz still holds them. Do you want to stay outside with them instead of inside the guild hall with them? Well, 
I don't really want to be out in the rain. Is there no awning? No. Okay, There's just not. don't let them get close to the others. Okay. All right, kids, stay near me, because I'm hugging them, too. <laughs> they all say simultaneously. Yes, father. Oh, that's creepy. I'm slightly proud of them for, the for you know, managing to mimic. They all simultaneously turn their head towards Rozu. No, no, no. Still grab that chest. Let's get <laughs> let's get paid. Or let's just give them some time. They need to get used to the emotions. Uh, I think I'm all, doing a great job. <laughs> you all start heading towards the main part, and you, you just see the uh, there is a lady working at the front desk, and she was like, "Wow, you made it here just in time before the storm." <laughs> yep. Um, the gamers have completed the quest of the ogres and. Goblins protect proof. Huh? Your proof. Oh right. I, I uh, slammed the chest on the on the uh, counter. Give me a strength check. Your strength or athletics? Uh either or. Doesn't matter to me. It, it's one of silence old chests, so yeah, sorry. Bad. <laughs> Bugger. Anyway. Uh yeah, you you pick it up with a you open it and <laughs> They may not have had enough time to start rotting, but it's still a very rank smell. And one more. Um, Synth, at least show them what you have. The head thing. Oh, right, yeah. I'll pull up. Ew. I'll pull up. <laughs> I pull up the head from <laughs> my fill build, I guess, or my fucking bag. <laughs> and not swing it around. Will this suffice? What is that thing? I heavenly i don't know it's uh you do uh, know that you're holding a mind flare head right yeah can i shake it up or down so I, can, can we get like an award for this or it makes that noise uh, she gives you a, a look of uh disgust rosu makes the same face right i big smile it's just it's just proof Wait. we're good at our jobs so what we do what do you look like right now? A uh, very creepy, unmoving smile. <laughs> no. What form do you have? Oh, human form. Okay. Oof. Yeah, we're in it. We're in it. <laughs> <laughs> I had to ask. <laughs> Give me a wisdom saving throw, Sim. I, I put it in the chat. Silence is just in cat form, so. Well, yes. Sim. You find it that you're not able to take your human form. Oh, no. Uh, How's everybody reacting? This is awesome. Uh, well, the fact that everyone has their hands on their swords should be an indication. I put my hand up and say, he ran into a cursed item. There's nothing to fear. He's still the same person. As a priestess, uh, I persuasion. swear. Persuasion. Okay, persuasion. Let's see. Do I have anything to help with this? Wait, you said as a pri as uh -huh. a priestess? Do you specify what god you serve? I'll probably be holding up my symbol. Okay, I'll give you advantage for that. Oh, <laughs> why do I have to protect everybody? Because you're the oh. mother of the group. Thank you. I did put it in chat. Everyone starts to relax just a little bit, but they're still very cautious about the black shadow demon with hair in their midst. Silence, like, stick her tongue out at everyone that has their hand on their weapon, like, slowly. <laughs> you Just, like, slowly see make your way around the room. You see, you see only one individual in the room who doesn't have their hand on their weapon. I'll give them a little wave, and everyone gets the tongue out. <laughs> uh, this individual is very, very... How, how to explain this? Very broad individual. Very large individual. Um, well, you, um, can I get a perception check silence, please? Oh, oh wow. Gosh. I see everything. Uh, uh, you thought my uh, eyes You can, uh, at first, when you're scanning the room, you couldn't quite tell, but you, soon you took a double take on that person and you realized it was not a large man. But a very manly woman wearing heavy, heavy armor. 
Wait, girl boss behavior. From the evil eyes party thing? Yeah, I think we met them once when you was bugging them. I met evil eyes, technically. You did not meet this woman. Oh, that's right. We she was not with them. Okay. She was not with them at the time. Um, so oh, you would okay. not be familiar with her. Uh, but you just see her look at this shadow demon, chuckle to herself, and continue drinking. <laughs> That's girl boss behavior right there. I respect that. I give her like a nice little wave. <laughs> she gives you, uh, she looks, sees you wave. She retracts one arm from her mug, gives you a thumbs up <laughs> as you just see her, like uh, you see a guy like, like fall against her, like drunkenly. You just see her just elbow him. <laughs> Right in the stomach, and he just falls down unconscious. Ooh, I like her a lot. <laughs> so, our contract is fulfilled, and I'm pretty sure we earned the bonus from this. Actually, this was way more than what actually request requested. <laughs> actually, we're, we're going to need to take the head to the king himself. What? No, I, I earned the spare square. We could talk to the king tomorrow, because I need to talk to him anyhow. I need to get this taxidermy before it's brought. Oh my gosh. Well, unfortunately, with the storm, all shops would be closed. Okay. Hold on. Price, Give me definitely. one moment. I look at the head, grimace, and despair of the dying on the freaking head. What the fuck? Uh, it's too long dead for you to stabilize it. Oh. Uh, what you actually... There bad. is a spell that can preserve it. It is called uh, Gentle Repose. That's it. I... It is a card spell. Checking through my yeah, list. Gentle Repose would work. He is right. Uh, oh, it's a ritual cast. Yes, I can totally do that. There we go. That one. See, there you go. All of a sudden, it's starting to look more pristine. Still very goopy and gross, but very pristine. And you have to touch it. <laughs> one finger. <laughs> and and by the way, you have to touch it for, let's see, it's one action, so it'll be 11 minutes. <laughs> no, no. One action is six seconds. Don't give me that. No. If it is a ritual spell, uh, you're casting a ritual. It is 11 minutes. Ew, 11 minutes. ew, ew. ew. You're touching it with your pinky and you're like, ew, 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 ew. <laughs> so 11 As... minutes, I am touching this thing. By the way, the teller in this time had gone back in the back room, fetched something and came back. She has switched out your chest for her own chest. Oh, good. Silence, sorry, you have to clean up your chest. I think we should get a bag of holding, so I never have to do this again. I am very sad. We have to... What are you talking about, Silence? The chest she provides is bigger. Yeah, but the other one was mine. Well, it, was, it now stinks, It so. was her first gifted chest by the king, so... Oh, well, we can clean it out for you and send it back. Oh, that'd be great. Thank you. No problem. Here's your reward. She opens up the chest... And all you see is a sea of gold and silver coins. After ritual casting, I'm going to do a slide of hand and wipe it on synth. Synth? I need a perception check. All right. It's not very good. It's clearly. <laughs> uh, you see her trying to wipe her pinking on your clothes. I'll smack her hand away from you. How? You want it to not rot, and this is how you treat me. No, girly. Ew. As you just see a gigantic hand give you a handkerchief. <sighs> Thank you. Ew, 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 ew. <laughs> I'll go ahead and hand over the, the head. I'm sorry, that was disgusting, As... even that you thought the body was hot or beautiful. Oh, whatever. please, that's nothing. Fritz is looking back and forth between the person who gave her the handkerchief, and then, it's like, Fritz is like, you're not going to thank oh, um, the lady? By the way, um, by the way, um, here are your new guild ranks for completing this mission. Oh, woo! Woohoo! Uh, what rank are we at now? You are rank Ori Calcum. 
Damn. How many more total? Shiny. How many to more adam total? To adamantine level? Yeah. One. Oh, that's so close. Just one more. You gotta keep grinding. You gotta do ah, it. I see that you improved. Name's Gugarn. Pleasure. Uh, thank you. Here's your, uh, handkerchief. He just grabs it out of your hand with a gunk and all gets on her thing and she does yep. not care. Okay. And you're the gamers? Gamers. Like, gamers. you play a game as a child? Oh, well, that's an interesting name. It's also a... As I chuckle. It's also a business title. She kind of looks towards Synth. I don't have any more chess points, sadly, so I can't even... I can't. I, I can't right now. I, uh, I mean, for your company that's going to be making these things. <laughs> it's it's kind of a part of the bit. I'm sorry. I it, Without it, I'm, I'm nothing. No. Oh, don't undervalue yourself like that. <laughs> I have no purpose without my chess piece. No. Whatever. You, you can kill people real well. <laughs> it means nothing. Uh, no, it's not something okay. to brag about. It's okay. We're just we're just making a joke. It's fine. No one will. Everyone in this building has probably killed at least one person. No. Oh yeah, I've killed hundreds. I have never killed exactly. Anybody. Okay, that's because you're a pussy. I'm sorry. <laughs> you're oh, a cat, not me. Damn. <laughs> yeah, but you're the one touching the thing like with your pinky, and that's just kind of sad. I'm sorry. Would you like to touch it? <laughs> yeah, I'll touch it. Give me like a gold and I'll touch it. No. I wonder if we can make the tentacles into sashimi. Okay. No, that's gross. Yeah, no, I have to. I'm, I'm trying to keep this as a trope. That's still gross. Uh, thank you. How much did we get so I could put it in our party loot and I could take out the ears and everything? Also, yep. don't forget you got the slime in there. And the head. Well, we'll get the head back later. Oh. So, how much gold, silver, and whatever we got? You might be well, I was going to say something, but someone decided to interrupt me. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, 50,000 gold pieces. Along with 100,000 silver. Okay, 100,000? Yep. 100k. Uh, 100k silver. I think we should buy one of those really big, like, cat houses. Like, the cardboard ones. Or, like... I don't know what they're made of, but we should get one for me. They're like, really big. This place don't have cardboard. Fuck. Yeah. Rich goes, I'll make you one out of, like, a tree later. <laughs> it's That's just called treehouse. Exactly. It's even better now. It's no, but tree. it'll be cooler, because, like, it'll be, like, Silence's tree fort, and there'll be, like, a sign outside that says, like, no, boys, icky. <laughs> Rich just looks sad, because he's technically okay. a boy. Okay, Fritz, can you tell when the storm's going to pass? And I cast Druidcraft. Give me a second. Uh, Gregorin looks over to Synth, gives and a long stare. Virgin! How about you and me go one on one in the sack? <laughs> what? Uh, you explain that way I can truly understand. Real <laughs> <laughs> suit jerks. Uh, the wording and everything, mm -hmm. and she gives a cough and is like, "Okay, Fritz, please tell me the time is soon." Fight, 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 fight. <laughs> that doesn't sound like a fight. <laughs> we we hey, phrase that in noble. Place. I'm gonna do a survival real quick to see how long it'll probably last. Uh, I'd say with this advantage. <laughs> um, <thing, laughs> I actually disadvantage. My bad. Uh, I. Well, with Druidcraft, you can predict the weather, so you don't need a survival. Oh, okay. Never mind. My bad. My brain just is going to survival immediately for some reason. Yeah. Um, for the next 24 hours, you can tell that this particular storm will go away in eight hours. Oh, dear Lord. This will go away in about eight hours. As you see, a little orb next to me. Uh, then good luck, Sim. I'm going to... Head off with silence here. Enjoy your time with I the business so here. You, you're not taking me from this. You want to have a massage and a hot bath? Oh, I think I heard what was happening wrong. <laughs> Good luck. I thought you meant fight, and I was really excited. Okay, never mind. You guys have fun. Wait, no. <laughs> yeah. I hope you win. <laughs> it's just because 
Can I can I guys take can I take you guys up on that bath? <laughs> uh sure. So how about it? We're Sim. We th- three are out of there. <laughs> Abandoned. <laughs> Damn. Right, well. on, you don't need to see this. <laughs> this is a worrisome situation. Uh, <laughs> we're slowly pimping him out. <laughs> How much taller yeah. is she to him, or are they about the same height? Uh, she is roughly about seven feet tall. Holy shit. Give or take a few inches. Uh, Sip. What's your height? Seven five right now. Oh, just barely above her. Okay. Oh, actually, you're the same height. Oh, uh, fuck. <laughs> uh, I so, die. <laughs> uh, so, you see how it is, is, and I'm going to take, is there any shot over here? Uh, there is one attached to the, um, uh, the desk that you turned in your thing for. Okay, so let me shadow into the desk, and I'm gonna use whatever I can to get out of here. So you, so you piece the fuck out. Oh yeah, you piece the fuck out. You're like, nope. <laughs> As she watches you f- jump from shadow to shadow, she gives you a hungry grin. Hungry ass. <laughs> You need to get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Die. When is a big, strong woman gonna ask me out? <laughs> <sighs> you really want one? It'd be nice. Okay. Uh, I'd be afraid that they might treat you as a pet, but okay. Mm, I'd be more scared of the men to do that. I, mm, huh. You know? No, I don't know because I'm not feline. Fritz just goes, well, if you think about it, in a weird way, cats think that probably people worship them. Exactly. I need a big, strong woman to worship me. (laughs) Mm, No, thank you. Not my types. Fritz Uh, just goes, are you also into giant women? Yeah. (laughs) Oh, I forgot you also like giant women. Oh, my gosh. Big, strong woman. Yeah. Yeah. Fritz saw her eye in sin, so... I'm like, okay, I'll let Synth have that. Okay. All right, we're gonna we're gonna take a quick <laughs> bathroom break. <laughs> Ooh, um, as we resume from our little temporary break, um, Synth, you managed to catch up to your traitorous friends. <laughs> I feel quiet. I follow like feeling that you're being followed. <laughs> <laughs> so you're stealthy. Yeah, I'm literally just hiding in your shadow. Uh, Synth, I need you to make a perception check. You do hear silence going like, why does he get all the fucking bitches? What the... Et cetera, et cetera. (laughs) Synth, you notice something extremely off-putting that you haven't noticed before. He followed me. No, there is a creature following you. As you just see long, spindly fingers wrap themselves around the corner of the hallway. You just see a shadow and glowing green eyes. As you see another lens stretch out throughout the entirety of the hallway, which is roughly about seven feet across. It reaches the other end of the hallway and grasps the other side as you just see spider-like limbs. Yeah, fuck that. I'm not hiding in the shadows anymore. You're not hiding in the shadows? I'm getting out of the shadows. I don't know what the fuck that is. Uh, as soon as you get out of the shadows, it's still continuing to follow you guys. Follow your, your party. Uh, as, like, it's full, like, body from what you can tell is still rounding the corner and it's it's huge it's 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 huge yeah i'm gonna start uh, trying to get the other attention though okay oh sit your back how do you keep getting so many bitches what the fuck bro guys Look, that's, I- it's fine we're just going to relax they actually serve meals in the bath it's lovely uh, yeah, yeah but- but do they serve bitches <laughs> There are triplets, no, quadruplets there. Oh, hold on, the bitches. 
hold you on. You can't the hold on the bitches. You keep getting all of them, and you're leaving none for the rest of us. Look, There's it's not my. It's my. Than than the bath, don't worry. If you thought, just give me a second. Like fuck the bitches right now. Oh, okay, that is just right mean. Now? <laughs> We're almost there. Okay. Oh yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Wee. <laughs> Woohoo! Let's get down to business. You get. I've been bitches. dying to get in the sauce. <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> They're very nice girls, okay? Can Silence and Fritz do like a high five? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> are we there at the bath or are we. <laughs> are we listening to Synth? Still going down the hall and Synth is in the midst of a panic attack. Yeah, we're t- totally ignoring him and talking about the bath. <laughs> Fucking hey, bitches. bitches! You're we're gonna start a new place. Black Send, you notice that one of the arms of this giant creature reaches past you and grabs something off of one of the people in your party. <laughs> As you see it, like another hand appear right beside you, strokes Rosu's hair. Do I feel said? And no, you do not. Question Was it in my line of sight because I could see into the ethereal plane? You I... cannot see whatever synthesis. Okay, have fun. <laughs> I think our dear um, bitch getting brother is having hallucinations. Oh, out of he character. hasn't said anything yet to us. Well, yeah, I'm saying this out of character. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, this is going to be lovely. I haven't had a massage in forever. Yeah. It's point. Only you can see. Me. Oh my god, I really am going off the deep end. They do give deep massages. No. God, I didn't know my ego was this big. As you just see the creature. Is fully out into like the the um, hallway. You see that the that interestingly enough, this creature looks vaguely familiar for some reason. And as your mind goes back to that stick that you touched, yeah. as you finally realize that this is the spirit that in habits the stick. <laughs> no wonder I can't see it. Yeah, because he is the one who touched the stick first, he is the only one who can see the spirit. Look, I don't know who you are, but this is a single, single room hotel. You can't be in here with me. Oh, how rude. If you don't want to join us, you don't have to join us. It's crawling on, like, stabilizing itself on either side of like the walls but it's like it's on the ceiling and its head is turned like 180 behind it just watching you constantly with a grin on its face bro you can't just steal all of the bitches and then like get yourself away from us you now have to deal with the consequences of your actions and teach us your ways hey alone can you please just leave me be you're the one who joined up with us. Okay, go go back to your bitches then. Chris goes, do you, do you need a hug? Is it okay? Are you okay? No, I'm not talk- I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to that uh, fucking damn it. Talking to what? I'm I'm seeing a uh, uh, shadow. I, I think look, you might have had I like don't your drink spiked anything. or something, bro. I'm pretty sure my sight will even catch invisible things. I don't see anything. I'm I'm seeing. I am seeing. I think a nice spa and maybe taking some time without the bitches might help you as you say this dragon or should i say silence you see a a very well toned woman walk mm. into the women's bathroom woo, woo, let's go <laughs> <laughs> did you just make a detour to the bathroom <laughs> No, I'm well, so no, weird. that's uh, that's what the baths are called, the bathroom. Okay. Uh, if silence wasn't covered in fur, she would be a, like a fucking shade of red right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go inside. You'll love it. Oh, the no. triplet, um, quadruplets, they never got what they're called, but you enjoy them. Plus, the baths are know. nice. Okay, uh, you all start undressing. Synth 
The creature is continuing to watch over you as you undress. I show and my then abruptly, <laughs> And then abruptly, it disappears from sight behind one of the sets of, like, places where you put your belongings. And Fritz, you see an individual that you did not see come into the bath, come out of the corner with intense emerald green eyes, long black hair that almost covers this guy's face. Fritz Cox and I, who is this handsome man? Dark circles are underneath it, each of his eyes. He's very goth looking. Fritz goes, I did not see you come in. Fritz does say that a lot. He wouldn't have in the first place. As he calmly goes into the bath. Buddy, is this a mixed what? bath or what kind of bath? It is separate. Okay. So men and women. Oh, yeah. In fact, there is actually when you start uh, like undressing, you actually see that the the quadruplets have enacted a magical barrier <laughs> over the separate open map uh, baths to prevent any peepers. Good, proud of you, kids. Brits. Yes. I meant you were the one who was peeping. I'm kidding. Anyway, <laughs> I'm peeping, but I get to stay on my side. Uh, <laughs> silence. All you have to do is ask one of the ladies. <laughs> you just, you just, her. you Trust just me, see. Rosie. You you come into the you come into the baths, and you, you just see the woman there who came in earlier. She has intense silver hair that goes down halfway her back. It's more of a mane than anything. <laughs> of how wild it is. She has intense purple eyes, very pale skin. And as she undresses, you see that she has rock hard abs. Oh, uh, she's human. Big strong woman. What? I said, is she human? Yeah, she looks human enough. Okay. She has normal human ears. Um, she's about, she's surprisingly like, she's about six foot tall. So normal size but she's just very well toned and built so still shorter than me okay as she looks as she sees you guys come in a very gentle smile creeps across her face good day she gives dragon a, a, a wink and she saunters off into the bath violence gives one back and just like looks towards rozu like excitedly go ahead if you want something to eat, tell me and guy. I'll order it's it up. Bitches. I think I'm going to get massage first before I dip in the bath. Okay, you have fun. Ta-ta. Okay, okay, you talk to one of the triplets. Yes. Quadruplets, sorry. There. Okay, well, that will be one gold coin, please. I give her five. The deluxe treatment, got it. Um, can I get a masseuse in here? You hear the, um... The sound of steps behind, uh, steps behind the doorway leading to the bath as you hear a knocking on your door. Yes. I am here for the massage. Uh, come in. Oh no, you, uh, uh, very well. Okay. As he comes in, uh, you do not recognize this individual. So that, I'm not sure if that puts you at ease or not. They don't have a disguise or anything on them, do they? Nope. Okay. Just a normal man. Okay. Looks fairly normal. Okay. He looks a bit older. Um, looks like he's been doing this job for quite the number of years. Has crow's feet around his eyes. A little bit of wrinklage on his mouth. Laugh lines. Uh, you can see the tips of his, the core of his hair is starting to gray. It's like, all right, let's start the massage, shall we? Yes, thank you. Oh, no worries. Just lay down on the table and I'll take care of the rest. Will do. <laughs> and as soon as he, like, touches your feet, he all of a sudden, he feels the tension. He was like, oh, my dear, you poor thing. A month's worth. Uh... Well, luckily for you, you decided to get the deluxe treatment. Don't you worry, young lady. You'll be relaxed in no time. As he puts on your spinal cord hot stones that are starting to relax you, yeah. Oh, out of character, I really want a massage. 
That's like my birthday wish right there. <laughs> my my birthday wish, if I, somehow I can get this to happen, is to have a hot springs visit. Ooh, yes. So we get the hot springs episode in, right? I know, yeah. Uh, Rozu, it is like that instant those hot stones hit your back. You are instantly like, uh, like starting to relax and you're just, oh, you needed this. And all of a sudden, the pressure of two thumbs hit the bottom of your feet. And all of a sudden, you hear a popping sound as all the blood like r- rushes back up, t- <laughs> up to your brain. And you're like, you're like, your eyes roll back in your head and you just fall asleep uh. because this is so relaxing. <laughs> Yep. Best um, idea ever. <laughs> fluffy, yeah, fluffy and uh, a synth. Yeah. You head into the baths. Yeah. And you see there's only one person, the man you saw before, just sitting in the bath. I sit five feet apart from him. Is he not gay? Synth, are you heat uh, resistant? Uh, I'm cold resistant. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm, heat, yeah, I'm heat resistant. Fritz goes through the process of washing himself off before going into the bath. Right. Because that is only polite. I was just wondering because I was like, I wonder how uh, well the water feels to you if not cold, if you're heat resistant. It's just water. <laughs> am I getting any... <laughs> Am I getting any feel good vibes from this water or am I just sitting in water? You're getting herbal remedies from this water. Uh, hey, it's very relaxing. But the temp for him. Oh, the temperature? Yeah, because he's heat resistant. So it's fire resistant. It's actually fire resistant. still yeah. very decently hot to you. Oh. oh but. As you just see the man looking in your direction. Hungry eyes. Oh. No, more like bored, dead to the world kind of eyes. As you, um, Fritz, you get done with. Um, I sit right next to yourself right off. Next <laughs> you manage to see as you come in uh, the end of this part. So be patient. As the person or creature, as you are aware, some gives you a very broad smile but you can't see any teeth. It's like those anime smiles where it's like really like crescent moon shaped, but you still can't see teeth. It's really creepy. So it's my image of bloody paladin talking. Yes. Oh gosh. And you come in Fritz and see the end of that smile as it goes back to its frown. By the way, Fritz is not shy. Does Fritz change the water once he touches it? Oh, I'm in human form. Okay, all good then. As abruptly, three sets of foot, foot come in, three sets of footsteps come slapping out of the thing as you hear Geronimo sploosh, Napalm sploosh, Pocahontas sploosh. Pocahontas? Fritz just goes, Guys, no swimming in the in the hot tubs or in the hot spring. Disrespectful. But dad, no buts. Behave yourself. They get a grumpy look as we go to silence. I. You go into the baths. I go into the baths. And mm-hmm. since yeah. we're streaming on Twitch, I can't go into explicit detail. But you see the woman take off her towel. And a mist magically, (laughs) like, somehow (laughs) appears in front, but you see everything. Spencer Fog. Wow. As she, as it's very evident, she knows you're watching. She just doesn't care. She goes extra slow with the towel. And that's where we're going to end the session. Oh, my God. I was about to start singing. You see the tongue rolling out. (laughs) (laughs) She turns into a dog temporarily. (laughs) Yeah. We will have the dog before midnight tonight. (laughs) This is a breathtaking pace.